Hi boys and girls and welcome back to Mr. Grable and our grade 3 ELA class where we read from collections and this one's called Carving New Frontiers and we have a poem today called General Store. Yeah, it looks like it's back in the olden days. General Store. Here we go by Rachel Field illustrated by John Mantha. Now when we look at a poem, often it will have some rhyming in it. And the rhyming usually occurs at the end of the lines. And I see right off the bat that this is true in this poem. I see store, door, wide, inside, everything, string, tea, crockery, bright, white, lunches, bunches, shelf, myself, say, and today. Look at that. <coughs> Rhyming pairs all the way down the end of the poem. It kind of makes it a little sing-songy. Let's give it a try. Here we go. General Store by Rachel Field, illustrated by John Mantha. Someday I'm going to have a store with a tinkly bell hung over the door with real glass cases and counters wide and drawers all spilly with things inside. There'll be a little of everything, bolts of calico, balls of string. Jars of peppermint, tins of tea, pots and kettles and crockery, seeds in packets, scissors bright, kegs of sugar, brown and white. Sarsaparilla for picnic lunches, bananas and rubber boots in bunches. I'll fix the window and dust each shelf and take the money in all myself. It will be my store and I will say, what can I do for you today? Kind of a cool poem. A lot of things in the pictures too if you want to investigate. I think that thing in the front is a scale and they weighed things. Very cool. Have a good day. Bye-bye.